Karim Benzema has shut down claims he is unhappy in Saudi Arabia and insisted he has no issues with the Al Ittihad manager Marcelo Gallardo, despite recent reports of a rift with the Argentine. The former Real Madrid forward was the Saudi Pro League side's marquee signing last summer, joining from the Spanish Giants on a free transfer. The Frenchman, who signed a three-year deal with the club, has performed well on the pitch but appeared to be struggling to settle in Saudi Arabia. Benzema was said to have been excluded from first 11 training after returning from his holiday 17 days late last month. A source said they couldn't even establish contact with him for 10 days as he holidayed in Mauritius, although he was reportedly stuck there due to a cyclone. The incident meant that Benzema did not travel with his teammates to their mid-season training camp taking place in Dubai. Benzema was subsequently dropped for their Saudi Pro League game against Al Tai and failed to make the squad for squad for their Asian Champions League trip to Navbarhor Namangan in Uzbekistan. However, Benzema has shut down claims he is unhappy in Saudi Arabia and said he has no issues with Gallardo. Speaking to reporters, Benzema said, I am back and now I am better. The story of my departure is not true and I am happy in Saudi Arabia. I have no problems with Marcelo, Gallardo, all those who say I want to return to Europe are liars. I am very happy at Al Ittihad. He finished by saying, for my part, I have no problem with anyone. Asked the coach about my absence, I was ready for the internship in Dubai. This is not the first time Benzema has hit back at reports stating he was unhappy in Saudi Arabia. He denied similar claims when speaking to GQ Middle East. Benzema said, it, being in Saudi, is a new challenge, and one, that I like, a long-term project and in a Muslim country. I'm not only a football player here in Saudi Arabia, I'm also an ambassador. I'm here to bring great European players in, in the near future, even if there are already great ones in the Saudi league. Our challenge is to raise it to the same level of the European leagues. Time will tell what happens next, but it will be myself who chooses when my career will end or not. Ultimately, I would like to be remembered as someone who started from the bottom and worked their way up to the top alone, and despite all the obstacles I have faced. That is something that makes me truly proud. Benzema's future in Saudi Arabia looked uncertain earlier this month, after reports that he stormed out of a first-team training session. As per marker, Gallardo had ordered Benzema to train alone but the striker refused his instruction and walked out. He was pictured training at the club facilities just a couple of days later, but only with the injured players. It had been reported that the relationship between Benzema and the club had soured after he returned to training from the mid-season break more than two weeks late. Benzema had crunch talks with the club's hierarchy at the start of February and was touted to leave in January due to being unsettled, but he stayed put.
The 36-year-old former Real Madrid striker, who earns £86 million per year, was linked to Premier League sides Manchester United and Chelsea during the window. A rumoured move to Lyon in his native France also fell through, which may have worked in Benzema's favour as he is adamant he is happy in Saudi Arabia.